Jordan, a 1-1 draw today against Bradford. Your reaction to the game? Um, uh, a bit of disappointment. To be fair, defensively, um, if someone would have said to us that we'd be one up away at Bradford with 10 minutes to go, then we would have taken that and would have liked to have seen the game out. But um, unfortunately, we didn't. But we stuck together even when they conceded. There was still 10 minutes to go, 15 minutes to go, and we stuck together. And with the backing of the fans um, getting behind us, um, we managed to hold on and see the draw out. But um, a bit of disappointment. But we're, we're proud of the way we played. But um, we wanted the three points. As you mentioned there, it's almost the bigger picture, the way the players stuck together once again and showed that real grit and determination. Yeah, well, it's a very hard place to come, you know, they get, especially when they're attacking that goal behind me. It um, feels like they're sucking the ball in towards the goal, uh, their, their fans are, so um, I think we stuck together out there as a team and we managed to defend well. Unfortunately, they managed to take the chance that they got and we go again Tuesday and hopefully we get the three points. As you say, we were 1-0 up during the game in the end, but do you think on reflection across the season it'll prove to be an important point? Yeah, I think, I think when you go away from home there's, over the season, I think there's really important points. You know, when, when, you're, when you're emotional after games, you always want to take the, the three points, but like you said, I think we will look into the future, especially if we win Tuesday night, um, then we'll look at this as a good point. There were a couple of chances in the first half. Paul Mullen had one to go, one that didn't quite happen, but in the second half, the chance he got, he took. Yeah, yeah, we always believe in Moors. You know, as soon as I was obviously back there and I seen the ball come across and I knew there was only one outcome as soon as the ball, ball come across. The one in the first half, I spoke to him in the change rooms, it was a bit too far ahead of him and tried his best to get on the end of it, but couldn't quite make it. But we always believe in all the strikers to get on the end of things and, and, more, and Moors did today. It shows that work and link-up play that Ryan Barnett and Paul Mullin had, the way the cross comes into the box from him. And this in the second half, the couple of times that Barney got in, didn't have the opportunity to cross, but that one he certainly didn't tuck it. Yeah, yeah, we, we work on, on stuff like that in training. You know, I think there's relationships all over the pitch and no matter who comes in and plays, we know where each other are going to be. And when Barnett gets the ball out wide, he knows that uh, Palms was on the pitch at the time. He knows where Palms and Moors would be and he just had to try and find the area and, and Moors was there. Obviously, for yourself on a personal note, a long battle in pre-season to rebuild yourself from injury. How good is it to get minutes like this on the pitch today? Yeah, yeah, it's, um, I'm, re I'm really pleased to get minutes on the pitch today. You know, unfortunately, I've come in because Az is not here today and he's been fantastic for us. But I've been, um, I've been really pleased to get out there. You know, I've been waiting my time. I've been patient. I've been playing the EFL Trophy games. Um, I've had to build my fitness up because a back injury, you lose a lot of fitness because you can't do much. So um, I've been taking my time getting my fitness back and I'm just pleased to be out there in front of the great support at the fan show today and, and just helping the lads as much as I can. Speaking on the occasion, over 22,000 people inside the University of Bradford Stadium today. The occasions you want to be involved in, aren't they? Yeah, 100%. Um, all the players want to be involved in days like this. And the, I know there was, there was double the amount of the fans that are at our home games, but our fans at home are just as good and they, they create just as much noise. So um, we're used to it as players and um, we thrive on it. So um, unfortunately, we never got the three points today. And a point to build on, though, for Tuesday night's game against Sutton. Yeah, exactly. I think I think it'll be a good point if we go and win on Tuesday. Um, but there's no there's no easy games in, in this league. Um, the league is a good league this year, and, and and teams will punish you. I've played against Sutton a few times in my career, and and the manager they've got now was there before, so um, I know the, the threat that they'll pose, and and they'll come and try and beat us on, on Tuesday night. Thank you, Jordan. No problem.